In case you didn't know, that's like 300 steps, maybe? So, you know, you're welcome, calves. Gingerbread. Future Kiara once more. Uh, Prague Night 3 um, was much tamer than Prague Night 2. Um, basically, I met up with <coughs> excuse me, some people um, who actually were in um, Vienna when I was there. We were in the same um, room in Vienna. And we only met like the morning that I left, so we didn't really spend any time together in Vienna, but they told me they were going to Prague next, so we planned to meet up. And we went to just a bar called the Lokal, L-O-K-A-L, and just hung out all night just talking about stuff. Um, so way less like involved than the night before, but I think it was probably something that I needed, just like a, a, a calmer day. And it was like... 
I th again, so cheap. Like, I had two beers that night, and they were both, like, pints of beer, and um, it cost me, like, maybe four euros total. Like, damn. It kind of hurts me now to be back in Paris and seeing all these prices, and, like, I wonder how hard it would be for me to learn Czech. <laughs> um, well, yeah, so... We hung out all night. We were just talking. The guys are actually going to be um, in Paris next weekend. So the friendship continues. Yay! <laughs> uh, yeah, um, that's my big up. And then I left the next morning at like 7 a.m. for the airport. Um, so I didn't have any like other things to do in Prague. Um, I just got in a taxi with two other people who were also flying out at roughly the same time. We went to the airport. I caught a plane to Frankfurt. I had like a three and a half hour layover in Frankfurt. That is the second time now that I have been geographically in Germany, but I've never like stepped foot outside of an airport. I've been in Munich when I went to Greece. I went, I, we had like a two and a half hour layover in Munich. And this time I had a three and a half hour layover in Frankfurt. So when people say like, oh, have you been to Germany? I always say like, well, technically yes, but I don't think it counts. Um, so really I need to go to Germany is what I'm getting out of this. Um, and then I came back to Paris, um, and I, at that point I was just so tired from, like, I had been running around, like, being a tourist for a week, and just, uh, that takes a lot out of you, surprisingly. Um, just, like, seeing things and, especially if you're in a place where you don't speak the language. Like, I, I, I just felt such a swoosh of relief when I got back to Paris and I understood everything that people around me were saying and I stood, understood all of the signs and like the advertisements and the, like I used to think that I was you know not very good at French because I couldn't understand every single word but oh my god coming back from two places where I don't speak the language coming back to a place where I do I felt like a goddamn linguistic genius I'll just say um anyway <laughs> back in Paris now uh, didn't film any of the, the trip because it was boring. Um, and I was just so tired. Like, I, d I couldn't even think straight. I didn't sleep at all the night before. I never sleep the day before I travel, or the night before I travel, because I'm, like, so worried I'm going to miss on my alarm or something. I don't know. Well, in any case, I slept really well last night. Okay. I'm going to stop these future Kiara videos now. Bye!